Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. So we just checked out the Grammys, right? Yep. Adele won six things. Adele fucking smashed it. And then we looked at all the rap things. Yeezy got nothing. Mm-hmm. Q got nothing. The only Drake won two things for best song and best uh uh, best, I don't know. best rap song with Hotline Bling and, and best else. rap song col- collaboration. collaboration. Same song, Hotline Bling. But the only other, but the chance to rap won best album, mm. best live performance, and best single. Best new artist, yeah. best rap album. This is what surprised me. I think Coloring Book was a subpar album. I thought Acid Rap and Ten Day beat the shit out of Coloring Book. Beat the shit out of it? I thought that the mixing on Coloring Book was terrible in so many cases. Hmm. I felt like it was a lot of stuff was sort of out. I love what he did with the album in terms of bringing people together and bringing so much uh, gospelness to it in a way. Right, I feel like a lot, of it was, a lot of it was overdone and I, 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 just, I just didn't think it was that good of an album. I feel like Views, as much hate as it's getting, was a, a good Drake album. I didn't think it was great, but I think it was better than, it was better than Coloring Book. And the thing about Drake's Views is it broke pretty much every record of it. it it beat the streaming yeah. records it beat the sales records it was mm-hmm. the number one for the longest record like he beat every fucking record that was set before him or that from every other artist he pretty much smashed everything and he didn't win it which blows my mind it, it blows my fucking mind I mean I, I'm glad that Chance won it because Chance is a dope ass I probably like Chance more than Drake but Drake deserved that more in my opinion this is what people would be arguing about and be like talking about like these under- independent underrated artists need more recognition and it's funny your response to this is what people have been wishing for for so many years it seems like Chance has the recognition now Chance has the recognition he's a big artist now he's got a huge following I just like I don't think Drake's a kick the Grammys to me is a load of shit the Grammys is like I don't give a fuck because the Grammys is based on like what other people, like people that are higher up that make the fucking decision. Yeah. The people don't make the decision. No. Certain other people do. Yeah. Uh-huh. So I don't fucking care. But the fact that they've chosen Chance of a Drake for whatever reason they went with is, is fucking stupid. It's culture, really. It's a cultural thing. Like, it doesn't matter if you or I don't like it. There's millions of people who uh, look at this awards show and put influence on it and put it on a pedestal. And so that means it's going to inf- have influence and have affect culture in some mm-hmm. capacity. I can see him Best New Artist, fair enough. I honestly think Anderson Park probably deserved that more. Because mm-hmm. Malibu, no worries. And every feature that he did that year was amazing. It was killer, man. He had killer. a great year. Really fantastic year. And it's funny because in the pre-show, I only got to watch a bit of the pre-show. And I was just, you know, on the internet. And it's funny... Park was getting interviewed and he was poking fun at Chance and he's like, "I'm sorry, big bro. I'm gonna have to take this one from you. You get the you get the other one. I'm gonna have to take this one from you." And Chance got him. He didn't get it. Um, part of me wishes Park got it, but he didn't. I I honestly think that Chance didn't. I feel like the best rap performance with no problem deserved it. Hey, but, not that I saw the but shout out to Solange though. Oh, cranes in the sky. Best, best R&B track. Big like, shout out. She, she beat out her sister B. Yeah, yeah. And Beyonce only won the one as well. Uh-huh. Beyonce got too many, man. She can just... Adele got six. What's with Adele winning everything? I don't get the Adele craze. She's got a good voice, but her music to me is pretty boring. I what do you... Find Adele how, how, much do you how much did you listen to it? Like, how... I listen to a few of her albums. I listen to all the singles that come out. I just, I just don't... Did you listen to it as a cohesive album? Yeah, I will admit from start to finish, it is it is good music. She does have an amazing voice and hit them notes well, and it does you know she does. It is good. I just I just I, just, I feel like it's just overhyped. That's all. Why do you think it's overhyped? Why do you think people kind of? Why do you think it resonates with so many people? Is it because it's relatable? I'm sure that's an aspect yeah, of it. I think it's relatable. I think why? I think she just um, delivers the way that she delivers her voice is definitely very emotionally powerful. Mm-hmm. So I can see why people resonate with that. I just, I don't know. I think just because it's not a genre of music that I like, the pop R&B blend, I just, it's just like, I don't like any artists that really use those things. So that's probably why. I just, I'm just not a fan of the genre. That's all. But I can see why people like it. I just don't see why so many people are. Shout out to David Bowie, though, for, yeah. for getting his Black Star album as the best rock, uh, well, Black Star's the best rock song. Well deserved. Um, I'm not familiar with David Bowie's music, but I'm familiar with any best alternative music album I'm familiar with uh, the influence he's had of, on a culture of rock yeah. and you gotta pay respect to that mm-hmm. 
but yeah, those are little a little Grammys talk and discussion. I don't really give too many fucks about the Grammys. I just really care about the performances. Like yeah, the weekend yeah. had a Starboy performance. Beyonce Ooh. did her thing. Um, we're trying to watch that, and that looked amazing. Um, those are just the most entertaining things for me. Uh, Kanye and Drake don't even attend the Grammys anymore, really? as, mu- as much as I'd. No one gives a fuck. I, you know, I read a, uh, a interesting comment. Why don't these artists create their own award show and create it how they want it? They have the equity. They have the um, logistic. They have logistical power. They have the money. They have they have the power. Essentially, is what I'm saying to create this uh, a structured organization that can have an award show to pay respect, just like Jay Z did with Title for his own streaming service. Okay, where's Title? Hey, how's Title going? I don't know. You got to ask Jay. I don't really True. pay much attention. <clears throat> but uh, I feel like that's all we got to say on that. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, a little Grammys roundup. For Jungle Beast Radio. You think this would be like season two? You think this would be part of season two? Like uh, season one's done. Like season two, episode one? Yeah, I reckon season two. Or do you two. think this just could be like Grammy's episode just by itself? I reckon it could just be a Grammy's talk. Without the season two? No, nah, you can make a season two. I don't know. You do you, do you man. 